Hi, this is Ale Lamy from Big Smoke Cigar Kuwait. Today we have a new Cuban cigars, uh, well known in the market. It's the Bolivar, but this time we have the Bolivar Regional Edition for Qatar. They call it Bolivar Oryx. This has been released 2011 and this is the box and you can see what we are having problem with the Ministry of Health Department they don't differentiate between cigarettes and cigars that's the warning and that's the warning if you didn't understand that cigar will kill you we'll proceed this regional edition for Qatar it's come 1000 box this is the box number 612 from 1000 rx 25 sticks this is the serial number you can see 1000 box twenty five sticks we'll open it they come in the original edition label Habano's label and what behind it God knows what this new sticker they implement now we'll have the, the Cuban certificate and the wax paper and then this is the the cigar 25 sticks, 25, what they call them, Oryx or Edmundo. They come on like that, two labels, the Boulevard label and <coughs> the original edition. here and we'll start our journey and our ride I was looking forward for that for a long time ago unless uh, then one of my friends in Qatar Mr. Al Muhannadi he helped me with this and for getting that box uh, thank you very much my dear friend Mr. Turkey and we'll keep this box here as we said, this is the Boulevard Oryx for Qatar. They come in a ring gauge 52 and 135. And the factory name or the factory name is Edmundo's. And you can say another name or the, what they call it a normal name is Robustos. Usually, uh, this Oryx or uh, this regional, it's the second regional Bolivar Edmundo size. The first one, this is 2011, the first one is 2009. It was the uh, Billix or for Holland, the originals. It was 2009, the Fabulosos they call it, the size of the stick. Very nice, what they call it, silky, light honey color wrapper. Uh, we, not, we cannot say again, this is a great construction, there is no soft spots, it's a ditch cigar, the three traditional three caps for the, the top of the stick, and the ditch, you can see the foot, it's a very ditch cigar, there is no soft spot, very nice, silky, great constructed, there is veins, but not ugly veins, it can be short, and uh, label we said the boulevard and the oryx label ring gate we said 52 and 135 length now we'll cut it and we'll see what they're gonna give us we're using the Zyka cutter very nice great cut as we said let's see I hope the draw there is no experience with these sticks before. Ah, thank God. Always I get my heart when I smoke a regional or something. It will be close, but thank God. 
the three aromas of three light aroma. It's showery. This box has been held with us for I think uh, two months or one month and it's from 2011 release. Very nice, well kept. As my, said, uh, my friend said, you, you are checking it very good. Very nice, soury aroma with a earthy foot aroma. We'll light it and see the right. Today we're going to get with the Turkish coffee so we can enjoy our right. Let's see. We'll toast the stick. Bolivar is having a very great reputation among the Cuban cigars. Mostly, you know, uh, most countries who like to, they have the chance to make regional, they will ask for Bolivar. There is a Britannia, there is the Benelux, and now this one, the Oryx. I hope one day we'll have a Bolivar regional for Kuwait. It's a quite well-known stick and have a reputation, never go wrong with it. Very nice start, very smooth draw and the smoke is coming from behind. This is a good sign. what they call it, very slick sort, nice. A woody start, and that's uh, showing you different blends. Usually the polyvar they have so <coughs> always they have the earthies flavors and a creamy smokes and uh, never you get a blocked stick with polyvar unless it was being mishandled or being uh, suffered in storing or something like that. You know, uh, I was suspicious because you know actually. So much people, they said, you know, polovars, uh, the Yorix, some of them, they are very, very close, thick and very heavy draw. And now I prove that you never listen to anybody unless you expert myself. Problem is, this picture is killing me. I don't know how we're going to make the end close up with this stupid picture. Very nice smoke providing. It's not thick, but it's a great. Usually the Cubans, they are not providing that thick, thick smoke like the non-Cuban cigars. But if they are smooth, that's enjoyment. They are giving you a, a rich flavor uh, plum of smoke.
earthy flavor now showing. The stick is constructed great and it's oily. The wrapper is oily. You can see it's burning oil. I mean it's been handled very great and not being mishandled. That's thank God that we have a great box. Cuban sticks mostly they have the earthy flavor as a tradition. I think it depends on the, the soil and how they have a rich soil for uh, planting the tobaccos. And this is what they make in very, very rich cigars or rich leaves. There is non Cuban rich seed like the Nicaraguan. But the soil is different. Very nice draw and very nice healthy flavor. Roasted coffee flavor showing now, and that's a little bit tough, showing some strength and enjoy the, the bitterness of the roasted coffee. or bearing with the Turkish coffee. Very nice roast coffee. We'll let it rest and we'll continue with the other on the second third of this stick uh, and we'll accumulate. You can see the ash, it's a great We'll construct it, but the burn a little bit not equal. We'll let it on. We'll see what it's gonna give us on the second. See. Hi again. This is El Elami from Big Smoke Cigar Kuwait. We are coming back with the Bolivar RX Qatar Regional Edition. This is the end of the second, third, uh, first third. You can see the ash accumulated. Little bit. The burn is not equal, but we didn't touch it, we keep it to fix itself. But the construction is great and you can see the dark grey ash, approximate it's two. We'll see the draw with this ash. Amazing smooth draw, it was a great flavor, started with woody, then Show us some earthiness and continue until the roasted coffee flavor it was amazing for the first third. We'll put the ash down and we'll see what gonna give us on the second third. Let's see with this great stick until now it's a great there is no problem. Even for the burn you can see after we put the ash is not that much difference will fix itself I don't have a problem with that and I don't think anybody will have a problem if they seek to provide a very great flavor beautiful rich creamy smoke providing with a smooth draw and lucky people they have this regional addition in our region I hope one day we're gonna get it I will stay behind it. Second, third, start cedary flavor. That's keeping showing the middle of the stick. 
That means this six be rested for a long time and enjoying uh, a good environment. So we can get it and enjoy the flavor that we have. And these being blended very good. There is a debate. Some people they said the country who asked for the regional, they interfere in the blend. There is different idea, different parties. Some people they said it's the same blend. Some people they said it's a less category of the, the normal line. Some people they said no, it's a special blend. It's a regional, definitely it's a special blend and to be recommended by the guy or the the lacasas of the country that been provided with the regional I goes with I think the the blend should be a difference otherwise it will be no difference on the stick than the other regular line and I think the the lacasa of the country should knows the client and what they prefer so they should be included on the test or the idea of the blend. This is my point of view and some people, they disagree with me, we have another idea. We can help each other on that. A hint of spiciness, so now, remove the label, the original one. <coughs> That's good. And put it here. So if somebody have a feedback on this debate, please don't hesitate and show us on our channel when the review was launched. Very nice spiciness. This stick is from my side it's going to medium, medium body stick, it's not showing any strength, very nice flavor but there is no much uh, boldness in it. It can, it can be smoked even day, in a daylight, you know, if you are not having a, a heavy meal. I don't think it would be a problem because it's not showing any boldness. Leathery flavor showing now. Very nice aftertaste providing. The nice thing is, Bolivar, when they are very great blended and be rest and it will be an enjoying stick. Uh, mostly you don't have any issues either with burn or draw, unless you know one or two percent it can be happening anything because it's a handmade. Anything handmade can be some error and this is cannot be counted. Nice leathery flavor. Let it rest and we'll see what it's gonna give us on the finale with this Bolivar Edmondo Oryx Regional Edition Cut. Hi again, this is Ali Lami from Big Smoke Cigar Kuwait. We are on the finale with the Regional Edition Oryx Bolivar. Edmondo. This is the end of the second third. You can see it's become equal burn. There is no problem. The ash uh, constructed is great and very nice dark gray ash. This is the end of the second third. We're gonna put it down. It was a great second third. Cedary, hint of spiciness. Then 
finalize the second with the leathery flavor. We're gonna put the label here and see what we're gonna give us in the final. Amazing draw, there is no problems. Uh, great plum of creamy smoke providing the flavor, they are great. I think, you know, uh, everybody will enjoy if they try this. Worth the try, actually. Very nice stick. I enjoy it until now. Earthy flavor come back again. It's very great flavor showing the, the original blend of the Cuban, of Cuban cigars. Very nice. Showing a balance by showing again as a flavor. Very nice size, actually. The Edmondo, as we said before, it was the second after the Pilix Edmondo Fabulosus 2009. Very smooth stick, very rich, creamy, and there is no issues, no bitterness. The cigar we take it in a cold draw, there is no problem. Uh, flavors going back and forth. Now the cedar flavor came back again. Definitely it's a balanced stick. It's amusing size wise, flavor wise and aroma wise. Congrats for Qatar to have this kind of stick. Actually, you know, Bolivar is uh, it's a crown for people who have it. Uh, size it's a great, but I think because you know publicity nobody knows and nobody it's not easy to read to reach it because it's in the Middle East I think so much people they will enjoy if they get hold of that smoke see the flavor it's domaining and amusing it's a great if you have it in the end of the stick it was a great a great ride for me and a great opportunity to have the chance to smoke this regional edition Bolivar Oryx and uh, I recommend it to all people all cigar aficionados who enjoy Bolivars it's a great smoke you can smoke it anytime it's a medium bedded stick with a great flavors uh, I hope you enjoy my review on that smoke and if you have any comments or any suggestion i will be happy to answer them and i still also want your comments on the debate between that the regional have a special blend being asked by the the la casa of the country or the cuban they will make a regular blend and just put a regional edition on it a regional label Thank you very much. This is Ali Alami from Big Smoke Cigar Kuwait with the Boulevard RX Qatar.